What up, what up, what up, what up? A word, Demarcus? That's what's up. I hope you get a crispy cut. What up, what up? Let me get more views. We're going to get into this box number three. I mean, they working your kid. They working your girl, y'all. They sending me all the goods, bro. Bag to back. So, we're going to get this back to back, all right? Um, just to talk y'all a little bit before I get a little bit more viewers. Um, I got this box yesterday, actually, and I put it to work off back, okay? Um, oddly enough, uh, my lady, her hair, she needed it washed, you know what I'm saying? And had a, had a situation going on, so I used the box as soon as it came through the door yesterday. Um, I used the entire line on her hair yesterday. And man, that shit came out bomb. So I can't wait to use it for myself. Um, and so I guess, you know what I'm saying? I'll show y'all the stuff. What's good, Jonathan? What's good? Brushing for great. What's good, Carly? What's good? Uh, my day is going is is going good so far. Um, uh, man, I'm getting I'm getting my grind on right now. So uh, feeling good. You know what I'm saying? Two cups of coffee in my system, so I'm turned. So, what's good? What's good? What's good? What's good, Mr. Way? You feel me? So, uh, they gave me the Superheroes Collection. All right. Superheroes Collection. Uh, shout out to Shea Moisture. <laughs> Y'all got some heat. Um, so, a Superhero Collection. Y'all, um, I got... I got some bamboo charcoal African black soap pre shampoo scalp scrub. And then I got some African black soap bamboo charcoal deep cleansing shampoo. And then I got my arch enemy, the silicone miracle styler leave in. Y'all know I hated it from the first box. So I'm not touching it. All right. And then we got a silicone free miracle mask. All right. So what it do, Corey? So I'm going to let y'all know what I did yesterday. A little bit of story time. I'm going to let y'all know what I did yesterday. It's going to be an Instagram exclusive as to how I use the box yesterday on long hair. All right. Then today we're going to demo it. We're going to use the products on my hair today. Just like every box. All right. We're going to show y'all what it do. All right. So let's get to it. This is the box. It's the box, y'all. All right. So this is the cleansing shampoo. As y'all can see, I use some once. Cleansing calm. It's got plenty of tea tree, y'all. Plenty. It smells just like tea tree oil um, and charcoal. And oddly enough, it smells good. Like Shea Moisture makes sure everything smells good. So um, main ingredients is black soap. Clarifies your scalp. Bamboo charcoal lifts impurities and absorbs excess oils. And tea tree oil removes buildup, enhances shine and volume. So um, I'm excited for that. And um, I got to get to this, bro. I didn't even do my hair yesterday, bro. When I use this in her hair, it's a scalp scrubber. I'm going to show y'all. This boy is the truth. You see this? You see this little prickly scrubber thing? This is used to go directly at the scalp and scrub the scalp for dandruff and, you know, nasty junk like that. And I used the whole tube on her hair yesterday by mistake. So I'm a little devastated that I didn't get to use this for myself. But this shit was A1, y'all. A1, bro. I'm talking about, listen. I know it's going to be overwhelming uh, showing y'all so many products, but at the same time, each box, I'm going to tell you what's good and what's not, what's needed to be bought and what's not needed to be bought and stuff that's really, you know, not, you know, over the hype or worth the hype. And um, this shit, man, really was a, it was, this was a good product. I'll get to that after. Like I said, I did that. I'm going to put that demo today on Instagram. Shampoo I'm using today with y'all. Um, it has some settling at the bottom. So if you go cop, make sure you shake the bottle. Make sure you shake up the bottle to get that charcoal uh, flowing through there. Like I said, man, um, 
The tea tree is real strong. You can smell it. Waivers. If y'all got dandruff, if you got dandruff, this will be the perfect line to cut. I'm, listen, y'all know I hated that last box, that wash and go box. I hated it, hated it. But this box, I'm in love. But the thing is, this type of shampoo shouldn't be used all the time because it's, it's really to clarify your scalp, balance your hair. So this is an as needed type of line when you've been trifling and your hair greasy and your scalp funky, smell like corn chips. This will be the best line to use. They gave me the arch enemy. You know, I had the little one on the first box. Hated it. What's good, Ellis? What's the deal? Uh, I'll get to that. I'll get to that other line in a minute. This is my arch enemy. I will only be using it in my lady hair. Um, and that's it. All right. I'm not using this. Okay. All right. You won't see it. This though, I am curious. Very curious. Y'all know I love my masks and deep conditioners. Um, I did a protein treatment maybe two days ago, so I don't need a deep yet. Uh, but probably Friday, Saturday, or Sunday, I'm gonna use this. Do a separate demo video for this. So look out for this. This is a moisturizing and anti-humidity deep conditioning mask. All right. So let's get into it. Um, first thing I want to say before we get into this shampoo is that on the back, it tells you to follow up with a balancing conditioner. And I wish that they had provided me with one. I wish they had provided me with one that would have been really good. So I had to dig into another box to find a good uh, hydrating conditioner. So we're going to pair these two. Okay. Let's get into it. I will uh, finish to get to y'all comments about um, the previous lines. I heard a lot of y'all in here loving that Manuka honey and repair. Yes, 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 yes. That Manuka honey and yogurt line is by far my favorite. Um, Shea Moisture going to have to work real hard to get me to like something else. Um, so I run a lot of miles on a motherfucking Shea Moisture that Manuka I ran miles with that junk bottle super low. So let's get into this wash. Um, I intentionally used lots of oils yesterday. Um, I used plenty of oils yesterday to really like get my hair oily. Uh, what's good swag? To get my hair real oily um, so that this shampoo, I can really see what the shampoo do. All right. So let's get to it. We bought the script. Where the dollars at? Where them dollars at? Where them dollars at? <laughs> Can't move. We're getting ready to wash. So, um, originally, like I said, if I hadn't used it all up yesterday, uh, this would have been the first step. I would have wet my hair and scrub my scalp with this. But of course, I used it all like an idiot. All right, so this would have been the first step. Okay, if you got dandruff, you got a funky scalp, and you trifling, you need this. All right, all right, not trifling, but you know what I mean. So we're just gonna jump straight to the wash uh, spray bottle. What's good? Let me get them likes up. 15 viewers, 7 likes. What's the deal, everybody? So this is going to be a scramble wash mission because I, just, I want that tea tree to get down to my scalp. Uh, share the live, too. Share the live. Let them know we live. Let everybody know we live. It's about time I gone in and hit my hair with that three. I'm gonna hit it with a three. Uh, probably tonight. 
trim it down with a thread. Then go in and get me a good taper in the back and a shape up and keep keep moving. I'm low key wolfing, kind of. I'm just keeping my hair thick. I've been keeping it a three grain. Every chance I get, I cut it. If it's thick enough for the three, I cut it. Um, and I'm not getting any more tapers. So no more tapes. I'm only going to work this area right here. No more tapers. What's good, Lotus? So, yep, no more tapes. Only here at the temple. No more tapers. So we're leaving it thick. All right, so. Hey, E, man, shout out Ellis, man. It's, Ellis is really like. I laugh at this nigga, but he's my biggest fan, dog. <laughs> Can't hear, but I respond. Oh, that sucks. All right, y'all. So we're going to wet this. I'm going to give y'all wolf tips, too, today. I'm going to give y'all wolf tips. Wolf tips and why and when and how and why you should do different stuff to to be able to preserve your wolf. All right, <clears throat> y'all thought I y'all thought I forgot about Art of. I didn't. Art of is dropping uh, this weekend. I will finish that series. Art of episode three. We're gonna pick up where we left off. It's going to be Art of Connections and Art of Getting Waves on the Sides. Okay. Art of Training Your Hair at Different Lengths. All right. So with the fire coming back, y'all, I just had to take a little break and get my mind right. You know what I mean? And <laughs> no more tapers. Carlin, it's a journey. Trust me. It's a journey. Trust me, bro. All right. So what's good, Ern? What's the deal? So yesterday, I'm going to give y'all a heads up. Like I said, I, I used this conditioner, this whole line on my lady's hair yesterday. And she bragged about how the, the, the shampoo really tingled the scalp. So you really know it's really cleaning your scalp. That was a plus. And the lathers was pretty good. My hair is oily, real oily. So the lather is working already. But if you don't know, if you got an unhealthy scalp, or if your scalp is healthy, a good tea tree treatment, bro, is always a good thing. Always a good thing. Our scalps, tea tree helps our scalp, um, cleanses our scalps, and uh, helps calm inflammation. Um, this was a pretty good combination they had, so. Uh, Keyshawn, I'm using the, um, I'll show you. I'll show you. <sighs> using the. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> Using the bamboo charcoal deep cleansing shampoo first. All right. So. a bomb lather for dirty hair. Real talk. So I 
Y'all stay tuned. I got a big, massive giveaway. Um, I'm going to really more so pick one big, huge winner to win a giveaway. Um, everything from brushes to T-shirts to products to do-rags. And I'm also going to throw in... I'm also going to throw in some uh, Shea Moisture products. You know this. Okay. All right. So um, my first wash is done. Um, my scalp feels like you get like a tingle sensation on the scalp. And uh, it's just like refreshing. You really feel your scalp getting clean. So that's a plus. All right. I'm skeptic. I really do not know if this is a good shampoo for washing style or not, but we will see today. That's cool. Wherever you share that, that's, hey man, that's, um, any share anywhere is good for me, bro. I appreciate it. All right. So I'm going to rinse this. Warm water. All right. Second wash. Matter of fact, I'm tripping. Hold on. Tripping, y'all. Tripping. Sug everywhere. Yeah, brushing for greatness. I saw a post the other day. Matter of fact, yesterday I shared it. Um, a lot of y'all really think it's all about what you put on top of your hair when it's about what you put inside your body too, bro. Gotta stay hydrated, like you said. So, leather is good. The lather is good. It might work good on the washing style. That's a good lather. It's a real good lather. You know what I'm saying? All right, so I'm going to rinse. Hair is not really dirty. Um, this second wash should be my last wash before I actually style it. EA the truth. Listen, Lotus doing her job. Lotus doing her job. I dare you talk to that woman like that. <laughs> oh, yeah, this going to be a good washing style shampoo. All right, about the rinse. All right.
All right, so we're gonna use a conditioner. Did I miss anything while I was going? What's good? All right, so we're gonna use this conditioner. All right. I know it's blowing the fuck up. Phone <laughs> wild. What's good, everybody? What's the deal? Anybody got this whole entire line? This was bomb, bro. I'm talking about bomb. All right, so. Was good, nothing original was the deal. Yeah, I swear to God, they cutting down trees, bro. And it's pissing me off, dog. They woke me up on my sleep, actually, cutting trees. They've been cutting trees since the crack of dawn. Was good, Drew. Finally, Drew in a building quite a lot. Listen to whoever out here going to cop that shampoo. Please listen to the directions to use a conditioner afterwards. Because when you use those, those shampoos that deep clean, um, they pretty much, they're going to strip you a little bit. All right. Because if you got buildup in your strands, it's going to strip it. Um, yeah, bro. Ain't nothing really, <laughs> nothing's really going to crack that Manuka honey yogurt line. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That Manuka honey yogurt line is just two beasts. This is a three-minute conditioner, so I'm just working it through, talking to y'all. EA, you use wild growth in your washes? Yeah, I used to tell cats to do that, um, but I don't like wild growth no more. That Regal 7 killing wild growth oil. So it's basically been over three minutes. I'm about to brush it through with the detangler. For real, good shit, Davion. I'm glad you tried it. A lot of people don't try my shit because they think I'm talking crazy, but it worked. Would be best to brush before or after you work out. Before and after. Brushing for greatness. <laughs> before and after. So usually you distribute the conditioner evenly, you know what I'm saying? And then anytime I scramble, I like to train my hair to lay back down. Uh, you can't just scramble, 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 scramble and expect your hair to just bounce back. So you got to scramble, brush it back with the grain, scramble, brush it back with the grain. So I'm going to work this through. And once it starts laying down, Once it start laying down, I'll rinse it out with cold water. And after I rinse it out with cold water, we're going to do the styling part.
What if? <laughs> bro, if they copyright me for that chainsaw, I'm going to have a fit, bro. And I'm taking it to court, bro. I'm taking it to court, bro. Don't say that. Don't jinx me like that, bro. I'm taking it to court and I'm fighting it. I'm going to beat the case. You heard? <laughs> yeah, EA, it's thick. It's real thick. You right. It ain't it ain't the best oil to use on putting it in shampoo. You're right. You're definitely right. That's why I use it when I'm when I'm worried about growth. I, I use it on I put it on my scalp, comb it through, then wash my hair. That's how I use Regal for wash days, but I haven't used it in a while because I haven't needed that type of growth. I'm keeping my hair thick and uh, my hair is growing at a good good pace right now all right so this was a three minute shampoo we uh conditioner we have exceeded three minutes so cold water rinse then we're gonna get to the style part and for those who new to the live when i wash and style i use conditioner 90 percent of the time okay i use conditioner a conditioning step before I add the shampoo in for the last step. So if you're confused, continue to watch. I break it down. Cold water rinse. All right, so this is the part where I stress that you hurry up, put your shampoo in. <sighs> right, it did stop as soon as you said that, bro. You, you know what? I appreciate you saying that, bro. <laughs> All right, so here we go. Shampoo part. We about to style the hair. All right, we're going to style the hair quickly, all right? Brush the shampoo through quickly, style the hair quickly, put it in place quickly, throw the do-rag on, all right? And then we're going to cold water rinse. Our brush.
I don't even know, bro. I really got to look in, in my phone and see how long it's been since I cut a three. Um, some people say I'm not cutting and I'm more so trimming. So I really don't know if I'm trimming or cutting. But um, the last time I, I cut a three, uh, I got to really see. I lost track, to be honest with you. How do you wash your waves? I wash every Sunday, uh, normally twice a week, but I'm kind of like up there with Wavy Crockett right now, getting three or four washes. Uh, I don't suggest you wash three or four times. Two times a week is perfect. All right, y'all. So I've, I've gone a little while too long. My hair is thick, so it's harder to style to get it into place. So, um, I have brushed a little bit longer than what I intended to. So I'm about to wrap it up, get everything set. So I can lay it down. Uh, yeah, sometimes. Definitely. I use those sometimes in my washes. Um, especially when I'm washing a lot. Hey, I forgot about that throwback, bro. I totally forgot. <laughs> I totally forgot about that throwback tape. wet do-rag makes it real silky one that ties up tight
brag it up. I'm going to answer a few questions before I dip. And then I'm going to rinse with cold water. I really don't know if I got the numbers. Um, I got a lot of royalties. I don't know them all by number unless it's one of my favorites. I wash until my hair dries. What? What? Hey, uh, I don't know how long I don't time it. I just try to make sure um, while I'm rinsing, I don't see no more soap in the sink. Or uh, when I pat it, y'all know when y'all pat it like this, you can hear if soap's still in your hair when you washing. I mean, when you rinsing. So uh, never rush to rinse. It can make or break your washing style. It can make or break your hair. Uh, so, all right. So I'm going to recap what I did um, for whoever's that's late or whoever cares. Um, got the new Shea Moisture box in. What's good, Wavy Crockett? Got another box, you dig? Um, African Black Soap, Bamboo Charcoal Deep Cleansing Shampoo with Tea Tree Oil. Um, didn't get to use the scalp scrub. Got my arch enemy, all right? Leave-in treatment. And, um... The hair mask. So the hair mask, mask I'm going to use probably Friday, Saturday, or Sunday. All right. We shall see. But I will use it live with y'all. Y'all already know this. So the lather was A1 on here. Uh, the cleansing was A1. The tingling on the scalp from the tea tree was clutch. Um, it feels like my hair got peppermint on it. My scalp is real cool. So uh, this is, uh, suggests that you use a good balancing conditioner after you use this. So I used the coconut hydration conditioner alongside this. And then I finished it off with a washing style with this. So that was it from the Shea Moisture Superhero Collection. Um, I liked the lather on that shampoo. It was pretty good. So I can't wait to unrag and see what it's like. Um, today's tools was comb, detangler, and a hard brush. Um, I plastic bagged my hair before I put on a do-rag. Um, to get a nice, good washing style, I suggest wetting your do-rag with cold water before you put it on. Um, it really, really gives you the good compression. And sometimes I like to spray my do-rag. So I'm going to rinse this washing style with cold water. So that's pretty much it. Uh, I appreciate y'all watching um, all day. <laughs> Truth, man, you be hating, dog. You can't be hating on the on the on Lotus, bro. You can't be doing that, bro. But uh, yeah. So um, stay tuned today. I'm posting a lot of content on my Instagram. If you're not following my Instagram, the link is down below. Um. If you are looking for a detangler brush or a spray bottle or even the comb that I use in this video, all of that's on my Amazon shop down below. And um, yeah, I can't wait till this dries um, to see what it's looking like, uh, see what the shine like, see if it's still soft. You know what I'm saying? Davion, I'm going to keep the heat coming. Uh, I might drop 
video Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Hopefully, if they're done being edited. So, it's going down. Um, I also got a big announcement that I might go live and make uh, after my hair dries. So, just keep it locked. Make sure you got the notification on, okay? A lot of people are subscribed, but you got to hit that bell so that has the little thingies around it. That's when you get the notification. So, 